Baltimore has always been a quintessentially Catholic city. The priests were the authority. Whatever they told you to do, you did. The city has its level of corruption. Sister Kathy exemplified this spirit of compassion and kindness. I have never had a teacher like that before. She was murdered our senior year, and it's always haunted many people in the community. Our mission, we were driven to find out who hurt Sister Kathy. People pop up from 45, 50 years ago who say, I have a story I'd like to tell you. I believe Kathy Sesnick was killed because she was going to talk about what went on at Keogh. There's an on-the-record public story of what happened to Sister Kathy. And then there's the world beneath. The police department and the state could provide protection for the priest. There were other people brought in, local business owners, politicians that were part of this network. I can testify that over 100 victims have been abused. Time is getting short for us to be able to figure out what happened to Kathy. My father said to my mother, you want to know why I drink? Because we killed a woman and we put her behind the shop. He said, see what happens when you say bad things about people? This goes bigger and deeper than we can imagine. The story is not the nun's killing. The story is the cover-up of the nun's story.